G'day, today we're going to have a look at another Next Fest demo. Uh, this one is Cook Serve Forever. I did play the original Cook Serve Delicious and um, the second one, 100% of the first one. Not so uh, lucky on the second. So let's have a look what we got going on here. There's a series of keys. Which are the ingredients you can, re you can rebind the arrow keys used on the keyboard in the options menu. X times, okay. So this small taste of what's to come. I'll hold that down. Not that one, okay. Oh. Or any. Love it, yes. Really interesting, like, uh, sort of console way of, um, not preview. Try and get some, uh, get some smoothness going here. All right. It's very much more like feels like an arcade way of doing this rather than I don't quite get what it means by not pre oh not previous, right, I'm with you. Is this related to Cook Serve Delicious or is it its own game? times that I press the uh sort of still writing on the the button of the previous one. Like that. Ah. Am I working on a timer or anything here? What's uh, how long are we going for? So the sun sunlight remaining. Ugh, my goodness. Ugh. It's something like that, I can't I have to be careful because I can't do the previous one. Oh my goodness. Cooking into the night. I just want to know what's coming at the end of this. How long do we go for? Ah. 
is like when you're in an arcade and you play a game and you do all right at it, but then it just seems to keep going forever. And you think, oh, we're done. That was the day. Okay. How did we do? That was sort of the, the demo, was it? What else have we got in our demo? Chill mode? I assume chill mode is just doing it, but like... It's going to be the same thing, but just with less... Less anything going on, right? So my, my genuine curiosity here is, is this in any way affiliated to um, Serve Delicious? Or is it its own thing? So uh, let's have a quick look at that. Yeah, it is. Okay. Definitely a different style to uh, the other one. Like I said, a bit more arcadey. I mean, definitely by the time they even got to, to number two, it was insane. Some of the stuff you were attempting to keep on top of. I'll just keep... Uh, we'll jump back out. Trying to see if there's any other tutorial's not gonna really explain too much. I guess we can sort it. It does feel like actually this would be much better with a, uh, a controller. If you're only limited to that many keys, like it has made it a much more of like a, a controller based game. Yeah. Okay. All right. Well, there's there's that one. Uh, definitely not gonna. I haven't played. I haven't finished two. Like I said, I haven't finished three, at all. I haven't played it. Um, so definitely nothing there to sort of make me want to jump straight to it. It does seem like they have changed up the dynamic a little bit though. So that's kind of neat. Any questions or comments? Feel free to chuck them below. Nice quick one there. Until next time. Catch you later.